which of the following structures contributes to the right border of the mediastinal shadow on PA radiographs of the chest? Let's visualize the PA radiograph of the chest. Part of the mediastinal shadow here is formed by the superior vena cava. And then we have the right atrium on the right side. This small piece here is formed by the inferior vena cava. This is the right border of the mediastinal shadow. On the left side, we have the apex of the heart. And the left border here is formed by the left ventricle. And then there is a small area here which represents the auricle of the left atrium. And then another region for the pulmonary trunk. And then, as you can see, the knuckle, the aortic knuckle, which represents the arch of the aorta. So this is the mediastinal uh, shadow. Now, let's go back to the question and see the options. Which structure contributes to the right border of the mediastinal shadow? We have just seen that the structures here are the superior vena cava, right atrium, and the inferior vena cava. So the right atrium is correct, but let's look at the other options. Right ventricle, the right ventricle does not contribute to the right or left borders of the heart. It touches the diaphragm. The right main bronchus is formed behind the mediastinal shadow and does not participate in the formation of the right border of the heart. Pulmonary trunk, as we have seen, it uh, contributes to the formation of the left border. And the ascending aorta is not related to the borders. Uh, the ascending aorta is present here in the middle and uh, does not imprint itself on the borders of the heart, whether the right or left border of the heart. So the correct answer here is the right atrium that contributes to the right border of the mediastinal shadow.